y'all can probably tell I'm not, in, I'm not in the best of moods, man. Come into this game, you know, the game start off instantly. I'm thinking, oh my God, look at the way they moving down the field. They getting in the box. If y'all hear that, that's the little air thing in the bathroom. Uh, don't mind it. Don't, don't pay no mind. I'm about to fucking rage. I think I'm going to fucking rage. Come into this game, I'm like, oh shit, we about to get blown out type shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Raheem Mostert is getting into the end zone. Two is getting these niggas into the end zone. And then we down 13 nothing. We come down the field. You know what I'm saying? We come down the field. Get a little field goal. 13 3. Then we get the touchdown. George Pickens. 10 16 going into the half. It's 10 16. Everything's going fine. I'm like, okay, the offense looks decent. You know what I'm saying? Then we get to the second half, and it's just typical. It's typical. It's the same bullshit. It's the same bullshit every time we play. It's the same bullshit. Matt Canada. It's Matt Canada. I'm not blaming nobody on this offense. I'm not blaming Najee. He ran as hard as he could. I'm not blaming Kenny Pickett. He played another good game, showed more flashes. Yes, he made mistakes here and there, but most of them was on the play caller. Not blaming this on Deontay. Didn't see no drops. Definitely not blaming it on the defense. They held the Miami Dolphins to 16 points. And in the second half, they didn't score. Well, neither of us scored. We went into halftime 10 to 16. The final score was 10 to 16. And the final score wasn't even 10 to 16 because their defense was strapping us. It's because Matt Canada's play calling. And it's bullshit, and I'm tired of it. I'm tired of the same old shit. This needs to be Matt Canada's last fucking game. This needs to be his last game as offensive coordinator because I'm tired of this shit, man. It's the same old shit. It's the same shit every week. And I don't even care. I'm cursing a lot. Just, I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off. Like, it's getting to a point where, like, what what more does he need to show you to be fired? What more do he need to show you? Because this shit is not going to fly. It's no way. It's no way. Our defense was strapping the hell out of their offense all second half. We got the ball, like, six, seven times. We couldn't even get in field goal range. We couldn't even get a field goal because you're trying to run the same fucking plays. Trying to do the same plays. Then the flags, the flags. Okay, the flags, he can't control flags, but it's just it's just disciplinary shit. But most most of the most of the shit I seen tonight is on him. It's on him. It's on Matt Canada. It's the same stuff, y'all. And I know y'all seeing it. And I'm tired of it. I'm tired. We just lost again. A, a game we could have easily won. This is another game that we could have easily won. It's no way. Our our defense strapped them, held them down to 16 points from halftime to the end of the game. They held it down. I'm so proud of the defense holding this. Tyreek Hill, Jalen Waddle, they're fast running backs. We held them down. And we, Matt Canada couldn't even give us, couldn't even get us into field goal twice to at least tie the game, to at least make it 16-16 with two field goals. Then they come down to it. What I thought was our last offensive drive, we're driving down the field, just bad play call. Bad play call. Good D by Javon Holland, but bad play call. Javon Holland picked it off, and then we stopped them again before the two-minute warning. We got two minutes, 37 seconds. We're coming up with a with an amazing drive. Amazing drive. Now, to be fair, Kenny Pickett didn't have to throw that ball. He could have just ran for a first down or find, found a man on the side of him to get the first down. I don't know if he didn't see him or not. But I kind of get why he threw it because it's Deontay Johnson and you got a backup cornerback on you. But I think Deontay was kind of running a, a kind of a comeback route and the corner kind of came back before he did. Once again, the ball didn't have to be thrown, but it's just play calling. It's just play calling. It's just play calling. It's just bad. It's just bad because it shouldn't even have came down to that, honestly. Honestly, it shouldn't have came down to that. It's no way we hold their offense to 16 points. We're down 10-16 the whole time. We get the ball like six, seven, eight times, and we can't get in the field goal range once. We can't put up two field goals. We can't make it 13-16. Even if we would have made it 13-16, all we, all we had to do, all we had to do is get in the field goal range. We could have made it 16-16, go to overtime. Whatever happens, happens. We get in the field goal range twice. We It's 16-16. We get the ball. All we got to do is get in the field goal range. Kick a game winning field goal. We walk out of Miami with the W, but no. Matt Canada wants to make it hard on us. Matt Canada wants to make it hard on us. And I was about to come here and bash Mike Tomlin, too, for him not going for it on fourth and short. But I like Mike Tomlin because he believes in our defense. He believes that our defense, hey, they've been getting stops all game. I'm going to keep, why, 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 why break it? Why break it? 
If it ain't broke, don't fix it. So I like Mike Tom LaFrey. He believed in our defense, and the defense stepped up. Didn't allow no points in the second half. But it's Matt Canada's fault. You can't get us down the field. You're running the same plays where the quarterback's running to the side and throwing the ball. Flags are fucking us up. You're running the same shit. It's the same shit every game. And I'm, I feel like I'm coming here every week repeating the same shit. I'm repeating the same stuff. The offense is stagnant. We got so much talent. Do you see the talent? Jalen Warren, Najee Harris. I'm I'm naming names again. Do you see the, the touchdown catch George Pickens made? Do you see the speed and agility on Deontay Johnson? Do you see how the, the frame of Chase Claypool? Do you see Pat Fryer move? Why do we... Why does Matt Kenna only decide to throw to Pat Fryer move at the end of the game over the middle? Why does Matt Kenna finally grow a brain? Like, this shit is irritating, bro. Like, us losing is so irritating. And Kenny Pickett, he he's showing that, look, I'm an NFL-ready quarterback. And we, I feel like... I feel like this whole offense is getting held back. Last year, we thought it was Ben, stagnant quarterback, 39 years old, can't move, statue, whatever the fuck you want to say. But I'm tired. I'm tired of this shit, man. I'm not even, like, tired, like, sleepy tired. I'm mentally drained from this fucking team. Not even from the team. I, I can't keep putting on the team. It's Matt Canada. It's Matt Canada, man. And the shit, the shit I've been seeing all year, bro, we... At most, at most, we should be sitting at four and two. I'm cool with the L against the Bills. We beat the Bengals. We lose that game against the Patriots. Why? Because Matt Canada can't get us down the field. Why? Because the defense couldn't stop the run. That's on them. I'm cool with losing that Browns game. We shouldn't lose that Patriots game. We definitely shouldn't lose that Jets game after being up 2010. 2010 in the fourth quarter, and we couldn't hold it the fuck down. Couldn't hold it the fuck down. Last week we beat the Bucks. It's just, it's just, just irritating, man. It's just <sighs> fucking irritating. Uh, it's no way we should have lost this shit. Or it's no way. It's no way we can't put up more than ten points when we had the ball seven, eight times. It's no way. It's no way Matt Canada can't get us down the fucking field. It's his fault. This game is on Matt Canada. For now, when we lose, it's on him. I don't know when we're going to fire this nigga. We're probably going to have him next week when we go play Philly and we're going to get fucked up. They're the best team in the league. Or one of the best teams in the league. It's dumb Bills, Chiefs. They're the top three teams in the league. We're going to get, get thrashed. They might beat us worse than Buffalo did. Especially if our offense looked like that again. Because it's Matt Canada. I see all the potential. George Pickens always open. Every If you really look at it, mostly everybody's always open. They're always open, but it's the play calling. It's the play calling. What is the rookie going to do? The rookie can't tell the offensive coordinator what to do. But if I'm Kenny Pickett, I'm coming out here and I'm, I'm playing ball. Fucking, I'm playing ball like I was at Pitt. Give me the fucking keys. Fuck your play calling. I make my own shit. Y'all follow me. Fuck it. We all young. Let's do what we want to do. Let's do what we know is going to help us win. But... Until Matt Canada is fired, hopefully we fire this nigga at the bye week. Hopefully he get fired tomorrow. If he get fired tomorrow, I'm celebrating. I'm coming here. With, I'm coming here with drinks for y'all tomorrow. Everyone should be drinking on this bit. This shit is this shit is ridiculous. We gonna have a fucking celebration. I'm throwing the confetti, all that. But I'm holding this camera. My arm getting tired. I'm mentally fucking drained from Matt Canada being such a bitch. Like this nigga's a pussy. Matt Canada's a pussy. I don't care. I would slap the shit out of Matt Canada. If I seen Matt Canada right now, I would stump this nigga's face in. Cause this shit is ridiculous. It's sad. It's sad. And I, I know I know y'all don't like seeing me mad. You know, I be trying not to come here mad, but this shit is ass. This shit is ass. Shit like this pisses me off because we shouldn't be losing games like this. 16 to 10. Had the ball eight, nine times in the second half and couldn't get two field goals. Couldn't get a field goal range two times to even tie it. It's bullshit. It's Matt Canada. Like the shit's ridiculous. The defense did everything they're supposed to do, not blaming nothing. Every time about we got four drop picks, shit, they was all stops though. They was all stops. And the four drops pick, they was kind of difficult. They was mostly all diving and Cam Sutton dropped the clean one, but it is what it is. They those were all stops. Those were all stops. Now that one Cam Sutton drop, it was to let them get a field goal before the half, but it is what it is. It is what it is, man. 16-10, second half. Can't get no points up. Final score was 16-10. Our defense held it down. Matt Canada's a fucking bitch. Needs to be fired. Don't care if I'm wishing a man out of a job. He fucking sucks. And hope he don't get a job nowhere else. Go fucking teach high school. This is the shit high school. Like, 
I don't know. I don't know, man, but I love y'all. Make sure I like, share, subscribe, man. Hashtag Matt Cannon is a bitch. Hashtag Matt Cannon should be fucking fired. And, yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Y'all be safe. Like, share, and subscribe. Fuck Matt Canada. That nigga's a bitch. If you see Matt Canada, slap the shit out that nigga and tag me in it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got all my socials and shit. Just fuck Matt Canada, bro. Like, he's a piece of shit. He's a pussy. And, yeah. I hope I wake up tomorrow morning and you say Matt Canada's fucking fired. Steelers are looking for a new offensive coordinator because this nigga fucking sucks. This nigga's a piece of shit. So, but yeah, that's all I got, man. I love y'all. Once again, like, share, subscribe. Everybody, please stay safe. And I'm out, bro. Fuck Matt Canada. Yeah.